At Woodland Hills, we want to make as big a splash for the kingdom as possible. Um, and we do that through podcasts and things like that and through our writings. But uh, to really get the kingdom on the inside takes more than just hearing a sermon once a week or reading a book. So my life changed when I experienced at age 26 a, an intensive, communal, school of a ministry apprenticeship. And when I met Greg in the early 80s, we found out that both of us resonated with that type of experience. We've always dreamed for like 25 years that this would happen at Woodland Hills. Aspen Discipleship is Woodland Hills Church's new theological and ministry equipping school, or what we refer to as our seminary for everybody. Uh, we're excited that in the fall of 2018, we're gonna be launching an intensive nine-month school. It's called the School of Missionary Apprenticeship. The kind of experience we're talking about is an intensive, ongoing communal uh, experience where people are getting both deep, rich theology, but also the practical side of discipleship, of spiritual formation, and of pulling those two worlds together uh, into a really unique thing that we're calling Aspen. I had a lot of great teachers informing my head, uh, but there was nothing done that was shaping my character, that was challenging me uh, in terms of my, my own spirituality, uh, teaching me about having a passionate prayer life, uh, teaching me about the importance of, of community and covenant and relationships, uh, teaching me about uh, the one another's of the New Testament and practicing those and integrating those into my, my life. All that was missing. We want to have a school that, that does the head stuff. You know, I, we want to challenge people intellectually, but we also want to challenge them spiritually and relationally and helping to form their character. An aspen grove uh, is a set of trees that shares the same massive root system. All the trees are actually connected. They have the same exact DNA and they draw their life from the same source. They also share their life energy that they get with each other through the root system. And this is a beautiful metaphor for community. Our vision for the church and for missions is that we wanna create vibrant, life-giving communities that are grounded in Jesus, sharing their life with him and with each other and for the sake of others in the world around them. And an Aspen metaphor is just a perfect picture of community. Look, I'm a Bible and theology professor at a Christian university, so I believe in the Christian university. But I'd say this to young people, maybe you're called to the Christian University, there's a time and place for that. But I know in my life, I graduated from college and then had this kind of experience before I went to seminary. It fits in different places, different times, and different people's lives. But an intensive experience like this in a community context is something you really don't get anywhere else. This isn't just for locals here in St. Paul or Minnesota. Uh, anyone from any part of the globe can, can attend and I encourage our parishioners and others uh, to consider uh, taking nine months out of their life and joining this community. Students from uh, all over the world or all over the country will be uh, living in host homes with host families during the nine months or they'll be living in shared community housing during the nine months. And that's an intentional part of the program where they're embedded in community so they can share life with other Jesus followers that will support their training experience and their learning experience in the school. I think what we see God doing in this world is raising up groups all over this planet that are recognizing a Jesus-looking God who's calling them to be a Jesus-looking people. That these are communities, young people, the next generation who are getting this. And we think Aspen can actually be a real resource to this growing movement, this kingdom movement that sees Jesus at the center of everything.